The latest innovation in treating a stroke is bringing the doctor and stroke treatment to you. And Houston will soon be the first city in the nation with a mobile stroke unit that can treat a stroke right in your driveway. Medical reporter Christy Myers has the exclusive in tonight's health check. They've never put a CT scanner in an ambulance before, but this isn't a regular ambulance. It's the first one in the U.S. dedicated to saving stroke patients. It takes over an hour once someone arrives in the emergency room to get treated. So if we actually put the emergency room in the ambulance and take the CT scanner out to the patient, we can do the CT scan right on the scene and treat the patient right on the scene with their medication and save over an hour. Dr. Grata says that hour could mean saving 120 million brain cells. We need a CT scan to the head, so the head would rest on a uh, um, uh, support to the, on the gurney right in here and do the CT scan. It takes about less than five minutes. To do. Fraser of Houston is custom building the ambulance around the CT scanner. It's also donating the ambulance and UT Health raised the money to buy the scanner. A four-person team, including a doctor, nurse, CT tech, and paramedic will man it. How many people will live who might have died? How many people will avoid the major disabilities that can come with stroke? Doctors don't have those answers, but they're going to collect that information when this mobile stroke unit hits the road in January. Christy Myers, 13, Health Check. But saving someone who's had a stroke starts with recognizing symptoms. Remember the word fast. F is for face. Does the face droop? A is for arm. Is there sudden weakness in one arm? S is for speech. Is the speech slurred? And T stands for time. You have a three-hour window for the stroke drugs to work. And call 911 if you believe someone has had a stroke.